Probably not right. All right, so today I'm gonna give the Daily Burn website a shot. I already started diving into this website and from the jump, I'm a little overwhelmed because there are so many choices, which I think is a really good thing because there's probably something in there for everyone. But for someone like me with like squirrel attention, I'm like, oh, that one, oh, that one looks cool. I don't know what I wanna do. So I'm looking for something like cardio, a mix of strength with a mix of not very long. I want it to be short. Challenging. Sweating in the warm up. So we're gonna do five minutes of workout today together. Doing a hamstring. Ah, ugh. Does anyone hear these sounds? Uncomfortable? Yeah. So that's what it changes. Don't need the sound effects. Yes. More of these. Number of times this guy's saying gorgeous. I'm feeling not so gorgeous. All right, so that was a bit of a doozy. I just did a 20 minute hit cardio workout. And we did a lot of jumping, burpees, squats, arms, name a body part. Hey, don't do that. Um, we hit it, no. Um, but it was a really good total body workout. The music wasn't quite there, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, just me. I'm a little picky. I'm not even that picky. I, I like a lot of music, but I felt the need to also have my own music playing on the side. There's something about these daily burn trainers that don't <laughs> want to tell you when to go. So I'm like waiting for them to be like, three, two, one, and go. So all of a sudden they're just like, nice work. I'm like, I haven't done anything yet. They're like, and you're done. I'm like, was I supposed to start an exercise? Okay, maybe I'm just not a good listener. Um, they're very informative, super knowledgeable on what the exercises should be working. Just did one of the daily burn 10 minute core workouts. There were some pretty unique exercises in there. Felt kind of funny, but I don't know, I was feeling the burn. Just did one of the daily burn audio outdoor running workouts. Lots of pros and cons. So I'll start with the cons. Um, they need to be really clear in a description of like an environment you should be in because I'll step out of my house and I just press play. They're like, okay, hopefully you're on a track right now. So this was a distance based interval and not time because she was like, all right, now sprint a hundred yards. So you're kind of having to guess. But what I liked was that the trainer was really informative and really talking you through your form. She used dorsiflexion, that big word a lot, talking about your heels and your feet and how they should be landing on the ground. So really informative, but I spent the whole time just like trying to envision what my body should look like versus just putting in the effort. I mean, clearly put in the effort. I'm like panting right now. I feel like I want to spend another hour just diving into this website because there are so many choices, um, over 2,000 workouts. There's all, all these different challenges you can take part in. So it's a little overwhelming, initially a little confusing. The more that you dive into it and try different things, you find your little niche in there. I need to spend some time doing my research. Maybe that's the point of what I should be doing here. I don't know.